Hello and welcome. I'm joined by Bhaskar Ghosh, uh, Group Chief Executive of Technology Delivery for Accenture. Bhaskar, thank you very much for speaking with us. So before I get to the industry, let me ask you a more personal question. What, what kind of devices do you wear or carry right now? I carry a simple device, my phone, mm -hmm. and this is my email, this is, tracks my health, okay. so this is all about technology in my pocket. Okay, so health, are you, are you also onto a wearable uh, health <coughs> device? Or? I, I think this takes care, I have an app here, so okay. it tells me how many steps I walk every day, mm -hmm. it reminds me and keeps me fit. Right, so health is an important aspect of, I guess, the whole technology challenge that's coming up. But let me ask you, when, when your customers today ask you for solutions, how are they, what are the kind of solutions uh, that they ask you for and how is that changing fundamentally? So I think um, in the past, most of the solutions were related to the technology solutions. Mm -hmm. You know, they wanted to bring some new technology or they wanted to do something faster, higher productivity and so on and so forth. But now with the digital technology, it is all about the business problem. Mm -hmm. So I believe that digital is more than technology. It mm -hmm. is about the technology and business. Mm -hmm. It creates the new business model it makes things faster. It helps to uh, reach customer in a much different way. So it will completely change Give the way. Give us an illustration do. that's top of your head uh, from from an example that perhaps you're working on or worked on very recently. I think there are multiple examples. I think the retail segment is one of the mm -hmm. areas where digital is uh, uh, is very very predominant. Where we see that whole the buying pattern of the customers are changing. Mm. We are always going the online, so earlier we used to do the online buying using our laptops and PC, now we do it over phone mm. and then we can track this uh, uh, movement, we can track the price, so it's a completely different shopping experience today we have with the digital ex uh, uh, technology. Right. So, what kind of pressure is it placing on you? I mean, the, the way customers are changing the way their own approaches to cust uh, their consumers. Uh, how are you coping with that and what's the challenge? First of all is a speed to market. Mm. In the digital, you cannot wait that client gives a demand and some clients wants to do something, you will, you know, develop something for six months, one year. That does not work in the digital. So, this speed to market need to be addressed. To do that as a technology service provider, we are using complete different set of methodology and technology. Now, now we talk about more of a agile DevOps as a standard methodology to drive the uh, speed to market. So that is one example how the uh, how we are addressing this problem. Second is that as I said, it's a more of a business. If I bring only technology skill, that may not excite the client. So I need to understand their business and the technology. So we provide the solution. As Accenture, you know that uh, overall organization we sit at the intersection of the technology and the business. One side we have a very large consulting right. practice and we have a technology practice. So we bring both technology and business knowledge to our client and that helps client to drive the digital agenda. So give me an example of uh, uh, something that you're working on, it could be even broadly, uh, that is sitting on this intersection and which in some ways represents a challenge for both you and your customer. I'll give you one example that for one of our, uh, one of our um, oil, uh, oil major client. So for them, their challenge is to monitoring the pipelines. They have miles and miles, thousands and thousands of miles of pipeline. So that was the business problem. So we came up with a solution with a drone. Hmm. So drone to manage the pipeline and hmm. the, the drone will fly over the pipeline, it will monitor and immediately it will give the signal and the oil pressure and everything will be managed automatically. Mm -hmm. That's a very unique solution, is IT solution which we may not have done earlier. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. so and if you were to now look ahead in the next couple of years, what kind of problems do you see cropping up uh, for which you will have to find solutions or perhaps you'll find, be prepared with solutions? I'll, I'll see w what I see the biggest change what is coming is that internet of things. Mm. You know we are telling the 40 billion things will get connected in next five years. Now once I connect so many mm, devices to my applications, there are two things come on my mind on top of my mind. One is the security. We need to make sure that whole connectivities are very secure. And second thing that you need to really transform those applications so that those, those, so that those applications can talk to the external world. So today what happened that in this industry, a lot of the applications we call as a legacy. So the legacy applications, they are like frozen. 
but the business is very dynamic, it is changing very fast. So, what you all need is more of a liquid application which will match the business requirement. Right. I think that is the mm, right. need for the hour. So, last question. So, uh, you know, companies like Accenture, IT services, uh, on the IT services side or the services side are very large. Uh, will this be, uh, will this continue to be a thing in the future? Because I can see companies, uh, let's say Wipro for instance, all saying that they see headcounts coming down, productivity going up. I believe that is in the digital world. Yeah, I, I believe in the digital world is bringing the technology agenda back. Hmm. So I think it can needs a different kind of skill, but it need to buy more investment is coming on the technology space. I see there is a lot of growth opportunity for all the technology service provider in the future in the digital age. Okay, Bhaskar, thank you very much for speaking with us. Thank, thank you. you.